Turning the pages back to the 24th of September 2022, we find ourselves in the midst of the January 6th House Select Committee hearings. Led by Democratic Representative Benny Thompson, the committee is working tirelessly to expose the truth and hold accountable those responsible for the January 6th insurrection. The committee, however, is not aiming for prime time slots, opting instead to reach the people in the middle. Despite this, there are calls for more hearings, including during prime time, to ensure the investigation remains in the public eye. The power of televised congressional hearings is undeniable, forcing the public to confront evidence of wrongdoing and reminding us of the risks to future elections. Fast forward to the 4th of November 2022, the political landscape is buzzing with speculation about former President Donald Trump's potential bid for the White House. This would mark a historic moment as Trump could become the first person since President Grover Cleveland to win two non-consecutive elections. But this is no cause for complacency. The threat Trump poses is real. With the United Republican Party, a GOP midterm victory could embolden Trump and make his prosecution more difficult. Democrats are urged not to underestimate this threat, as Trump's potential candidacy could lead to a fierce assault on Biden, exploiting election deniers in positions of power. Rewinding to the 13th of June 2022, Jeff Duncan, the Republican Lieutenant Governor of Georgia, makes a bold statement. He argues that any public official who fails to condemn the infamous January 6th Capitol invasion is not fit for office. He believes voters won't punish GOP candidates who stand up against Trump's election lies. Duncan insists on the importance of elected Republicans acknowledging the truth about January 6th. He warns that aspiring Republican presidential candidates must appeal to middle-of-the-road voters who reject election lies. Duncan concludes that Trump is a liability for the party and Republicans must distance themselves from him to regain credibility. And that, dear listener, was a quick dive into some of the top news stories from 2022. In a world that never stops spinning, staying informed is our best defense. Always remember, knowledge is power.